frequently asked questions we're up in the 30s now i think uh got a dodge truck here the uh the bed of the truck did not fall off uh this is just a good way for us to get access to uh to, to the fuel tank and uh, i'll get to the uh the point of the video uh we do have some nice equipment that makes it a lot easier instead of trying to use uh, four or five guys or even a, a lift to lift the bed and have two lifts down uh, or roll them back and forth, we can just do this. So what this one came in for was uh, a check engine light with an evaporative leak. Not a, It was not liquid from like gasoline, but it's the, uh, the gases that come from the gasoline that are recycled through the engines for United States, uh, EPA, clean air, well, you know what I'm talking about. So anyhow, so that was the code, and this is what we're trying to, what we're working on getting fixed. This uh, is a Dodge uh, half ton. Yep, 1500. It's um, it's old enough that the uh, tank is no longer available for the thing. We've tried, uh, you know, OE aftermarket things like that, and we couldn't find one. And this upper piece in the fuel tank is actually made into it, and. Uh, since we can't get it, plan B is to fix it. And we've, we've done several of these now um, where we have actually taken, there was a giant crack here, and we don't just glue the piece that was leaking the, uh, the vapor um, under its system pressure. We actually uh, cut out and make and print a new piece that can go inside, a new plastic piece that extends this all the way in here and then they glue that on top of that to reinforce it, and then they'll put it all back together. Um, it's also not uncommon that if you're getting one of these uh, small or large evaporative leaks in your Dodge truck um, to watch how this routing is here on these plastic lines. A lot of times we find these broke, and these are routed up under this uh, vapor line is routed under the wiring harnesses, and as things sit and sag and settle, we find it'll pull these down and instead of just being we'll go back with it straight across but as we got it this was underneath so if yours is underneath there and you're making this repair get it out of there and stick it on top so it's a lot more relaxed place and i hope all that's getting in there so that's the uh frequently asked questions i'll post uh some of the in the uh, comments and or descriptions some of the uh, evaporative codes that you might be getting and this could be a problem uh, that's causing it. Please remember to like and subscribe. We really appreciate your support and we'll see you on the next one.